The affirmation of a father's blessing is one of the most significant events in the life of a child. The absence of a father's blessing is one of the most destructive. I grew up without my father's voice speaking into my life. He wasn't there to tell me about my heritage, nor was he there to prophesy my future. My father's voice was muted. I did not know him. I didn't know who I was. Inherent to identity is purpose. If you don't know who you are, you will not know why you are. My entire childhood and teenage years were a foggy blur of confusing events. Relationships were always a struggle. My life was aimless and harmful. I was working alone in a strip coal mine at 3 a.m. when I called out to God, Do you know me? I asked, Do you care? That night, I heard for the first time the affirmation of God's voice. Yes, Neil, I know you. And I've given you the spirit of a son that you may call me Daddy. You can't imagine what that single event did in my life. Hearing the voice of God not only gave me an identity, but He also revealed my purpose. This series, The Father's Wound, we're digging deep into the matters of the passivity of fatherhood. The collateral damage is immeasurable. This week, we're talking about how to be an honorable son. What do you do when your father's voice has been muted? How are you to be honorable? There is a promise to children that if we honor our fathers and mothers, we are ensured a long and prosperous life. But what do you do when they were not honorable to us? Join this series and let's get some answers to the father's wound.